2,000 years ago, someone near Baghdad buried what might be the world's first battery. Could ancient people have known electricity 2,000 years ago? In 1936, near the windswept ruins of Kujut Rabu in modern-day Iraq, archaeologists made a discovery close to the remnants of Ctesiphon, the seat of power for both the Parthians and the Sasanians. These clay jars had a copper cylinder inside and an iron rod, just like the core of a modern battery. But here's the thing, this was around 250 BCE, there was no light bulb, no wires, no concept of electricity as we know it. When filled with a simple acidic liquid like vinegar, the device could generate a small electric charge, around 2 volts. So, why build something like this? Some scientists say it was used for electroplating, coating objects in metal like gold or silver. Others say it might have had religious or medicinal use, like a shock therapy to awaken the body, but there's zero written record, no mention in ancient texts and we've never found wires, switches, or anything nearby. An alternative explanation posits that they were simply storage containers for sacred papyrus scrolls. Was it a scientific fluke or proof ancient civilizations knew more than we think? The Baghdad battery still sits in a museum, still unsolved. Follow Aaron S. for more lost science that still shocks modern minds. Check out our video on the real Roman medicine secrets or the cursed tomb found to continue your journey.